hi guys welcome back to my channel so the day i made this video was the day i traveled back to nigeria there was something i saw on in this airport that i want you guys to see so the first time like when you get to this point and you stop here and you walk inside while your driver um drive to a certain extent and also <laughs> come out of his car and walk inside and then um, I think this is a uh, for security checkup. So, but uh, in all the places I have been to, like I've never seen this kind of thing, like this kind of uh, thorough checkup. And I don't know the reason why they are doing this, but this is so very um okay and beautiful for security reason. So there's something I want you guys to see after this part. So immediately I came out. At first, I don't know that my driver was also. Uh, come out i was thinking he would drive the car and they will search him up but surprisingly he came out as he came out i'm like okay who is driving the car and the car was basically driving itself or i don't know the way they do it or something underground and um, is pushing was pushing the car but that was what i saw and i was like wow this is so beautiful one thing i noticed through my time of uh, staying in kigali is that kigali is so bent on security like there are in every place you go there are this uh, sign or bell that you can ring if you're in like in danger you can basically push that bell and it will alert the police the place the you put the bell that you are in danger and they will come to your rescue guys i don't know why it it is like this maybe because these people have some history but honestly this is so beautiful their security is so tight and then um, like i have not been to many countries but i think this is one of the most secured country i have ever been to like everything is so bent on making sure that everybody in the country is safe and um you are okay and free but guys i want to know your opinion let me show you more of uh, kigali airport i've not seen this before the country is so very fine like you guys, this is kigali international airport uh, this is pretty good. See that? It's 1 a.m. and I'm going by now. As for somebody, we're not to pay So one thing I noticed in this airport is that there is nothing separating the arrival and the departure. I don't know, in Nigeria, the arrival is downstairs while the departure is upstairs. So once you're driving, you basically just go up. Then if you're arriving, you're going like you're coming down. So uh, that is how it is. And um, I think that is also how it is in many other places. In Kenya, when we we arrived... I did not see anybody coming to board a flight. But here, <laughs> once you drop, you don't know the place to pass, like the right um, path to pass. Everybody is passing the same route. The way to both, um, both parts of the airport are downstairs. So the thing is just like this, this part, like the arrival is facing one side, while the pressure is facing the other side. But once you guys are at the field, like, everybody will you will not know who is arriving and who is departing like it's, it's very very confusing for me and i was like okay where should i pass where 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 and you know that this place if you're asking some people question most of them don't understand english that you you are most likely to get ignored basically arrival and departure is in the same place this is the passion. That place is the passion. I pass through the passion, and this place is arrival. <laughs> it's not like every other part, uh, airport. Then every other place is. Um, and every other place is parking, parking lots. 
So this place I'm passing now is Arrival. Guys, I'm hiding to her. I don't want people to know what I'm doing. My phone is there, my, my bags are there, and my phone is inside. So, do you see that? Do you see that? What I know is security is so tight here. This place looks so different from every other airport I'm seeing. It is not. It's not like it does not have a um, um like upstairs like um like I don't know how to say it. It does not have a up parking lot everywhere or underground parking lots. Another thing is that every car is parked like at the place you're seeing them. So there's no underground uh, parking lot. And uh, also there's no like high top roof parking lot. But this airport is so clean. Guys, this place is sparkling clean. Like I, I did not vlog it the way I supposed to vlog it because I was scared because um, I don't see much people having fun there or vlogging or um, putting camera in people's faces. But... Had it been, I have the time to vlog it or show you guys. That place is neat, clean. My bag is down there. I kept my bag down there. And uh, I've been into their airport. I forgot to stream. So their airport basically is not as big as every other airport I've been. Like, uh, it's not as big as Nairobi airport. So it's not even as big as a Nigerian airport. But it's still very fine. Cute. Okay, guys, let's go up. My flight is by 1 a.m. Um, I'll be here for a long time. Azaba. Abaza. So, um, <laughs> uh, see as I leave my phone, my bag. Guys, I want to ease myself. Jesus. Okay. I've been here for like um, hours. Very hours. Hey, Jesus. I've been here for so long. Wait. 